So put your old Fed hat back on, Randy, if you would. Sure. Uh, how do you interpret these data? So we're right on the 2.0 number. Bang you know, on. Boy, they set a target and they're going to hit it. Yes, <laughs> yes. And, uh, and so I think they've been doing a very good job of raising rates in anticipation of inflation. In the past, I think uh, the central banks and, and as well as the Fed have often been a little bit too late. Inflation heats up and then they start raising rates. And so the Fed has been trying to do that in anticipation of uh, the uh, inflation. And I think they've done a good job so far of sort of getting that balance. Right. So how much more anticipation do we have coming? I mean, well, I think, so I think December looks likely at this point. Take us likely. into 2019. Where are we? Well, that's that's going to be the most challenging time because it's pretty easy to to kind of keep getting us up towards around two and three quarters, three percent, which is roughly where the Fed sees its policy not being uh, accommodative, not being stimulative, just being kind of kind of balanced. And that's going to be the question. Are they going to go beyond that or not? What happened to the neutral rate? Do we still pay attention to? Is Chairman Powell paying attention to? It sounds like he's sort of saying, you know, I'm not sure exactly where it is. Well, I think that's always been the case that we're not sure exactly where it is. And I think he's been much more straightforward. That's one of the, the things that uh, people have talked about a lot in the markets, that um, Powell has a different way of speaking because he's not an academic. And although he says the same things substantively that Janet Yellen or Ben Bernanke or I would say, but he says them in a way that I think is a little bit more straightforward and just says, well, we're not so sure, which is true.